there is a car that is a legend. It has been winning races for decades. But how do you make a legend better? You make an ACR that goes even faster. It's an important day for us. It's a very exciting launch of a car that has become a legend in the performance community. The Viper itself has been the performance halo for the Dodge brand for over 20 years. And there's another legend built with inside that Viper, and that's the ACR. It's a big name to live up to, and we're gonna take it to the next level. You know, last year we sent a shockwave through the performance enthusiast market when we launched the Hellcats. And we were very careful on how we positioned those cars. We position them as muscle cars, not as track cars, because we believe we already had the ultimate track car in the Viper. When you think about the 2016 Viper ACR, you really have to put it in a perspective of the history of the 20 plus years that we've been building the Viper. I mean, think back to the first generation Viper. The Gen 1 Viper had 400 horsepower, had no air conditioning, had no ABS, no traction control, had no windows. Fast forward to today's car, the Gen 5 car. Not the ACR, but the regular Gen 5 car is a completely different car. We have now 245 more horsepower, but is now managed with an electronically dampened suspension, ABS, traction control, and stability control. But don't think for one second, just because we put a leather interior in it, cutting edge infotainment, and a Harman Kardon audio system that is not a full-on track car to its core. You know, for the last couple of years, Viper has been involved in the Tudor series. Matter of fact, last year we won the championship. And that time, that development in that series was critical for the development of the 2016 ACR. From the new suspension technology, with a fully independent, manually adjusted suspension, with rebound and compression, and three inches of height adjustment. We even took out the bushings in the mounts, and you now have spherical bearings that hold the coilovers in place. That combined with a brand new, specifically designed for this car, Kumo race tire with a 19 inch front wheel. We've also got an all new brake package with a 15.4 inch carbon ceramic brake rotor and a six piston Brembo caliper. And we have an all new extreme aero package from an all new front splitter that is adjustable, four dive planes in the front, removable wheelhouse vents to a rear diffuser that runs all the way into the rear end with adjustable strakes and the crowning jewel, a six foot dual plane wing. Put all of this together with the suspension, the new wheel and tire combo, and this extreme aero package, it allows you to carry 1.5 G loads through high speed turns with 2,000 pounds of downforce. You know, we're not ready to release our testing results yet and our track times. We want to get a couple more tracks under our belt before we really come out with the performance of this car. But I can assure you, the 2016 Dodge Viper ACR will be the fastest street legal Viper track car ever produced. And when you consider how five years later the previous generation car is still highly respected and is number two in the Nürburgring, that tells you how confident we are about this package. We launched the one of one custom program for the Viper. We're going to let you do that on the Viper ACR as well. The only hand-built American supercar and we'll let you build it any way you want.